Kamal Preet Kaur booked her ticket for Tokyo 2021 by breaching the Olympic qualification mark of 63.50 meter at the 24th National Federation Cup Senior Athletics Championships held in Patiala and also finished first in the competition. However, being first in the Federation Cup was not new for her, as she was also the gold medalist during the 23rd National Federation Cup in 2019 with a throw of 60.25 meter. So apart from achieving a spot for Tokyo 2021, she did something significant in this year's Federation Cup. She became the first Indian woman to bridge the 65-meter barrier in discus throw as she sent the discus to 65.06 meter. The previous record was 64.76 meter set by Krishna Punia in 2012. Kamal Preet Kaur comes from Kabarwala village of Punjab. Coming to athletics was also tricky for Kaur as she chose athletics for just having a try on the insistence of her physical education coach as she was not interested in academics and Kaur finished fourth at her first technique. She told in an interview recalling her earlier days. I was really bad at studies. There was a step meet and my coach took me there. I feel I finished fourth there and everyone told me I had a good physique. Then I thought, let's give sports a try as I am not that great at studies. However, because of their poor financial condition, Kaur was initially reluctant to pursue athletics career and her mother also insisted her not to pursue a sports career, giving examples of some other girls who could not make a mark. But my father, Kuldeep Singh, supported me. And when I won medals at national level, they felt hopeful. Now when I have qualified for the Olympics, it has given them tremendous happiness, she said in an interview. Kamal Preet Kaur was a shot thrower in her initial days in athletics and was ranked number 4 in Punjab in shot put. After joining SAI Centre in Badal, Preet Palmaru, the coach there, suggested her to opt discuss throwing. According to Kaur, from where she belongs, it was normal for girls to get married at a very early age. So it was important for her to do well at studies and join a good college. Otherwise, her fate would have been the same as other girls from her village. Kaur was determined not to meet her fate and being not that much good in studies, she wanted to do something different. So she thought sports would be a ticket for her brighter future, avoiding early marriage. After getting a chance in ACI, she didn't get a seat in the ACI hostel, so she had to put up in the hostel of the Smesh Girls Senior Secondary School, from where she also finished her 11th and 12th. The basic problem she had to face there was of maintaining a good diet. ACI hostel would have provided her a diet that is needed for athletes, but in her hostel, she got a normal diet. At the start, she often missed the morning sessions because of cold winter mornings. But after winning a medal at national level, the world changed for her. She won a bronze in the junior nationals at Bangalore in 2013. But when people were clicking selfies with her, she got motivated. The attention she got for that medal actually did the work, not the medal as she stated. It just struck me that if this is the attention I am getting with this medal, what will happen if I get to represent India? I suddenly become more serious. I had already been training at the center for two years. I saw that the girl who had won a gold was happier and more people were clicking selfies with her. I feel that I should have been in her position. It's a normal human trait to like being appreciated. From there on, the training became more serious and I was getting up early and making sure I didn't miss morning training. I became much more disciplined. 
from getting motivation from clicking selfies, here we are today with the national record holder Kamal Preet Kaur. Under 18 and under 20 national champion in 2016. Sixth at 29th World University Games in 2017. Fifth at Asian Athletics Championships in 2017. Fifth at Asian Athletics Championships in 2019. Gold medalist at 23rd National Federation Cup in 2019. Gold medalist at 24th National Federation Cup in 2021 with the 65.06 meter throw and a ticket for Tokyo. Kamalpreet currently trains under Baljeet Singh, who claims his word has the potential to bridge the 68-meter mark in near future. But he is concerned about the foul throws ahead of Tokyo 2021. In an interview, he expressed his concerns about course techniques. She keeps her legs too straight. She needs to bend her knees a little, which will give her extra grip and reduce foul throws. We, the crew members of Kilovers, wish her all the very best for the Tokyo Olympics 2021. Our primary focus is to highlight those who deserve spotlight in the field of sport but do not get enough of it. If you want to be part of the initiative, do share the videos as much as possible. Like, comment, subscribe our channel for more videos.